people seem to be getting faster. Maybe it's the shoes or the swimsuits they're wearing, or maybe it's the way we train. But do you think in a similar way that people are getting smarter? Is that why records are being broken here? Sure, I could I could probably do that because I mean I personally um, I think my practice majorly has not been through pen and paper so- solutions. It has been aided by software a lot, right. and I would say that that's something which um, which I think plays a very key role. It's this way, right? I mean, there's two ways to approach, let's say, running. One is to keep running for that hundred meters, expecting growth, or do ten k runs, do runs with weights do runs with something else, train yourself in 10 different things so that eventually when you come back to this, you're better. Mental calculation and the art of it is slowly in decline, which is, I mean, when I look forward, when I, when I talk to, let's say, 60-year-old war veterans, 70-year-old war, war, war veterans across the globe, or I mean, whenever I go and talk, they're way quicker at what they do than, let's say, people of my age or under because of the, um, the reliance on um, calculators a lot. Which is great. For instance, I mean, no one really wants to calculate cost 46 and a half. We don't really want to do that because there's machines doing it for it. So when I compare it with the sport, this is exactly what I say. And I think I'll probably repeat it here, which establishes the point. Usain Bolt runs for 100 meters, right? The reason he runs for the 100 meters is to make sure and inspire people into say that, okay, see, this is what being fit is. It's not that he does not have a car. So uh, it's not that he does not have a car. So I would I'd probably end up with that saying that if you're today, if you're here, you should probably be using Wolfram Alpha. If you're here, you should be using your MATLABs and Mathematica. If you're not, you're not in the math game. But at the same time, it's extremely important for you to train your brain. And there's no better exercise than counting. And, and trust me, I'll, that's that's literally what I put here. Brain exercise is, is I, I personally think that math, if you lose out on calculations to be a way in which you train yourself, you're sort of uh, missing out one one part of the jigsaw puzzle. 